In a world where pigeons and rats lived together, an unusual friendship blossomed. Picture this, a towering tree, home to a flock of pigeons. It was their safe haven, their sanctuary. But it was not only the pigeons who called this tree home. A family of rats lived in the roots, a bustling underground abode. The leaders of these two groups, the head pigeon and the head rat, shared a unique bond. They were the best of friends in spite of their different species. The pigeons had a rhythm to their lives, a daily routine. As the sun painted the sky with hues of orange and pink, they would take flight in search of food, leaving their treetop home behind. But as the moon took the sun's place, they'd return to their tree, to the safety it provided and the friendship it housed. The day was usual until the pigeons discovered something unusual. The sight of scattered grains was too tempting for the pigeons to ignore. As they fluttered around in their daily quest for food, a lone pigeon spied a generous spread of grains on the ground. With an excited coo, he informed his fellow birds, Look, there are a lot of grains spread on the ground, let's savor this unexpected feast. Yet, the head pigeon, a wise old bird, felt a twinge of suspicion. There were no fields nearby, no obvious source for this sudden bounty. He cautioned his flock, urging them to resist the tantalizing grains but his warnings fell on deaf ears. Another pigeon, brash and impatient, dismissed the head pigeon's advice, leading the others down to the ground. They pecked at the grains, their caution forgotten in the face of temptation. Suddenly they realized they were ensnared in a cunningly hidden net. They cried out in fear and surprise, their freedom snatched away. And just like that, the pigeons found themselves trapped, their freedom snatched away. In the face of adversity, the head pigeon had a brilliant idea. He knew that unity was their only hope. If we all fly together, we can lift this net and escape, he said. And so, with a shared goal and a collective effort, the pigeons summoned their strength. With every flap of their wings, they lifted the net a little higher, a little further away from danger. It was a sight to behold, their unity transforming their distress into a beacon of hope. And as they flew, they carried not just the weight of the net, but the power of their bond. Once they reached a safe location, the head pigeon called out to his old friend, the head rat. With their sharp teeth, the rat and his group set to work, gnawing away at the net that held the pigeons captive. It was a testament to friendship and unity, crossing species and overcoming obstacles. With the help of their rat friends, the pigeons were finally free. The story of the pigeon and the rat brings forth several valuable lessons. It's a tale that reminds us of the core values that should guide our lives, no matter how young or old we are. Firstly, let's talk about unity. The pigeons found themselves trapped, unable to escape the bird catcher's net. But when they flew together, they were able to carry the net and reach a safe place. This teaches us that when we work together, when we are unified in purpose and action, we can accomplish great things. Even challenges that seem insurmountable can be overcome when we join forces and work as one. Next up is the value of friendship. The pigeon and rat, despite their differences, were good friends. When the pigeons found themselves in a predicament, it was the rat and his group who came to their rescue, using their sharp teeth to cut through the net. This shows us that true friendship isn't about being similar or having the same interests. It's about being there for each other in times of need lending a hand, or in this case, a sharp tooth when your friend is in trouble. Lastly, we learn about the wisdom of listening to elders. The head pigeon, sensing danger, warned the others not to go for the grains. Sadly, his advice went unheeded, leading to the pigeon's capture. This serves as a reminder that our elders with their lifetime of experiences often have insights that we may lack. Listening to their advice can help us avoid pitfalls and navigate our journey more smoothly. In conclusion, this story is not just a simple tale for kids. It's a reservoir of wisdom for all of us. It shows us the power of unity, the beauty of true friendship, and the importance of heeding the wisdom of our elders. And so we learn that unity, friendship, and wisdom are the stepping stones to overcoming any adversity.